Hello friends, uh, in this video we will see a problem related to the ports and streams. So the problem is like the difference between downstream speed and upstream speed is 3 kilometers per hour. Okay, and the total time and the total time taken during upstream and downstream is three hours. Is three hours. Okay, so what is the we have to find? So, what is the downstream speed downstream speed if the downstream and upstream distance are 3 kilometers each ok 3 kilometers each so it is given that the difference between the downstream speed and upstream speed is 3 kilometers per hour right so we know that the downstream speed is uh, greater than always upstream speed so that means the difference between downstream speed minus upstream speed is equivalent to 3 kilometers per hour and the total time taken during the upstream and downstream is total suppose he is traveling from this position to this position so total time taken to travel to from A to B and B to A is 3 hours so that is given 3 hours total travel distance so down to and what is the downstream speed if the downstream and upstream distances are 3 kilometers per each that means it is given that A to B distance is 3 kilometers per hour ok so we take that uh, so the difference between downstream speed and upstream speed is 3 kilometers per hour so that means I take upstream speed as x kilometers per hour so then the downstream speed is going to be equal to x plus 3 kilometers per hour ok 3 kilometers per hour so now the total time is given as how much 3 hours to travel from A to B and B to A so the time from travel to A to B plus B to A is given as how many 3 hours but A to B distance is how much 3 kilometers and B to A distance is 3 kilometers and the speed traveling from A to B is x plus 3 kilometers and B to A is x kilometers per hour so time is given so we know the distance and speed so from that we will get the time traveling from A to B so A to B distance is 3 kilometers and the speed is x plus 3 kilometers plus B to A distance is 3 kilometers and the speed is x kilometers so that is equivalent to 3 so now we will solve this equation so whatever value we are getting the value of x so that will give the speed of the downstream as well as upstream so this equation and this is going to be equal to so 3x plus 3 into x 3x so 3 into x plus 3 equal to 3 into x plus 3 into x ok so if we solve this equation so what we will get 3x plus 3x plus 9 equal to so 3x square plus 3 into 3 9x so it is going to be how much so we take this one to that side so that is going to be 3x square plus 3x and minus 9 equal to 0 so we take 3 outside so we are going to x square plus x minus 3 is equal to 0 so we know there is a formula to find the square roots of uh, a quadratic equation so that is going to be equal to the square roots is going to be equal to minus b plus r minus under the root of b square minus 4ac by 2a right so where b is the coefficient of x and a is the coefficient of x square and c is the constant part okay so by substituting this one so the values of x going to be get here is so x is equal to 
minus b. So that is 1 plus or minus under the root of b square b square minus 4ac. So b square that is going to be minus 1 square. So 1 plus 4 into ac minus b square minus 4ac. So minus 12. So that is going to be minus into minus plus 12. So by 2ab. So 2a. I mean a is 1. So this one we got minus plus or minus under the root of 13 by 2. So root 3 is going to be minus 1 plus or minus root 3 root 13 is going to be equivalent to 3.6 by 2. So this is we are going to be get as so the speed is I mean the x is what actually the speed so the speed is never going to be the negative so that's why actually we take here plus value only. So minus 1 plus 3.6 by 2 so that is going to be equal to so 1.3 kilometers per hour. So what is x? x is the upstream. So if x is equal to upstream that is 1.3 kilometers per hour so then the downstream speed so that is x plus 3 so down speed is x plus 3 so that is going to be 4.3 kilometers per hour okay so then we have to find what is the downstream speed we have to find so the downstream speed is what 4.3 kilometers per hour so I hope you got this one. Thank you very much for watching this video and please subscribe my channel.